Last month, singer Natalie Cole performed here on The Early Show. She was not well, but shortly after she found out her life was actually in danger. Recently, she spoke with Mary Hart, host of Entertainment Tonight, and Mary's with us live in the studio. Good morning. Good morning. It's good to see you again, but in person this live time, Mary. Very yes. nice, yeah. You know, I did spend an afternoon at home with Natalie just the day before yesterday, and to say that she is doing much better truly is an understatement. She is doing amazingly well, but she was very, very sick, Harry. You noticed it when she was here. Mm -hmm. She felt she was uh, performing terribly and apologized, but she's roaring back now. She's ready to get out there and perform wow. in a few weeks, but is still undergoing treatment, and it's all been very serious, and I, I want you to just take a look at what she looks like right now. Okay. Gee, it's great after being out late Walking my baby back home When Natalie Cole performed on The Early Show in September, she already knew she was infected with hepatitis C, the result of her admitted drug use years before. You haven't been feeling so great. No, right? I've been yeah. a little under. A little, a little under. under. Yeah. <laughs> Got a, some hepatitis thing. Yeah. Right. So that's got you a little it's very challenging little challenging yeah but natalie didn't know how challenging it was about to become a week later she was in the hospital tell me about that early september appearance on the early show you were much more ill than anybody knew yeah that's very true i was so sick plus we had to get up at the crack of dawn my breathing was starting to get difficult so singing interestingly, was not a problem. How'd you choose the, choose the songs? Well, we call them delicious songs. Mm. So, but standing, so I, I or even talking to Harry, was, uh, it was very laborious for me. It really You really know, was. everybody says that about Harry, though. Oh, no, don't. Harry's a sweetheart. This is just for you, Harry. <laughs> <laughs> hand in hand to a barbecue stand. Just days after appearing on The Early Show, Natalie got devastating news from her doctors. After lying dormant for decades, her hepatitis C infection now threatened her life. They took x-rays and they said, you got to go in the hospital right now. Oh, my Your, gosh. Your uh, lungs have filled up with fluid. Your kidney function is less than 10%. And I had no idea. I was in denial that I was close to dying. I had no idea until within three to four days of me being hospitalized, they put me on dialysis. They said if they didn't put me on dialysis, I would, I would not be here. Coffee time. My dreamy friend, it's coffee time. Natalie found out she was infected with hepatitis C early this year while recording her new album, Still Unforgettable. We stop for a while, he gives me a smile. I stuck with my head to his chest. Natalie says she's feeling much better. And while she has a few concerts scheduled, the only road she's on now is the road to recovery. When are you going to come back and perform on the early I'm show? I'm going to be so much better when I come. <laughs> Now, wait a minute. You were not bad. Oh, Do you think you I were thought, bad that yeah, morning? Yeah, I thought I was terrible. But I will come back, and I will be fabulous. And she's already on her way to being fabulous. You know, she told me the interferon is really a heavy-duty drug. Yeah. And uh, her liver, however, has bounced back mm. to 80% of normal. And that's because of the interferon right. treatments. And she needs a kidney transplant, perhaps? Well, Harry, what happened? Her kidneys started shutting down. That's what they discovered wow. here in New York in the hospital. Uh -huh. and, and what astounded me was she is such a hard worker. She said she's, she was in total denial. Yeah. In fact, she she wouldn't have gone to the hospital had her mm. girlfriend not heard her laborious breathing on mm. the phone and said, mm. I am sending my doctor to you now. Yeah. She could have died within a matter of hours. She is such a treasure and has oh. such a talent and has such an amazing spirit. I yes. was so concerned about her that morning when she was here. That just, uh, I'm so glad you caught up with her and that she's doing all right. Well, and it really is that spirit. Harry, I've known Natalie for a long time mm. and you're right. She is an icon. She's a treasure. And immeasurable talent yeah. and right now she is not back to singing she you know she needs a few more weeks she has a couple of appearances but she literally just a matter of weeks ago could barely walk up the two steps to sit down oh, gotcha. remarkable woman and yeah. great attitude and what a pleasure to see you Mary Hart in person in our studio so great 
Well, it's great to be here in New York with you. You know, we unfortunately are fighting serious fires and tremendous winds and heat in California. So it's really a nice of uh, a nice breath of brisk air here. There you go, Mary. So great to see you. Thanks.